Okay, good morning, quiet places. Today we are at Cloudland Canyon State Park. And there's a whole bunch of trails here. I've heard a lot about it. People have recommended this place to me. And I'm looking forward to it. Right by the main trailhead. And uh, so the problem is today is that there are thunderstorms expected. So I think I got about an hour or two. I'm going to see what I can do here, see what's available. And we'll just take it by there. Thanks. All right. So I'm up here at the top of the waterfall. Check it out. Okay, so here's the waterfall. Don't go here. It's actually very slippery and dangerous. Probably shouldn't be here myself. But there you go. Very nice. All right. Uh, this is one of those Georgia forests that have this kind of primeval feeling to it. A lot of moss, very overgrown, a lot of trees. You do see that a lot up here, I've noticed, like by the Pinati Trail. Um, not really so much when I get up to like the Smoky Mountains, Blue Ridge Mountains, when I was up there, but maybe there are places like that too. But uh, anyway, yeah. Um, Yeah, this is the West Rim Trail, and there is the Waterfalls Trail, which seems to go down into the canyon and obviously goes to the Waterfalls about three miles. I'm taking the West Rim. This is just the one I heard is the one to take. So, pretty nice. All right, so for those of you wondering what... The West Rim Loop Trail looks like at Cloud Canyon. This is pretty much it. If you're familiar with North Georgia or, well, Pinati Trail, I'd say Alabama, you know, kind of standard kind of trail. And just been going around. It's pretty quiet here. Nobody's haven't seen anybody since I was by the waterfalls. Not sure if people go in the waterfalls. I think they might. Looked like there were a couple of people there in bathing suits. Anyway, there's a road that I stepped out to. And it looks like I get back on the trail. So I'll check in with you guys later. Uh, probably when I get to closer to the canyon. All right. Okay, I don't know if video can really show it, but this is really cool. The canyon and the mountains right here. Just look at that sky. I can see why they call it Cloudland. I'm guessing that's why, because it is kind of cloudy up here. trying to imagine that this is what all of this land looked like only a few hundred years ago and now it's mostly been cleared well maybe not mostly but a lot of it so if you were one of the explorers or if you were in the Cherokee tribe or one of the other Mississippian tribes this might be some place you had to walk through. All right, so this is kind of cool. 
going all the way down these stairs. I think it leads to the waterfall. And uh, see what's going on down there. Maybe if it's... I can go take a dip in the waterfall or something like that. I don't know. This thing really goes down far. But um, <clears throat> we will see soon. Okay, so we got two waterfalls here. We got Cherokee and Hemlock. No swimming, climbing, or wading in creeks and waterfalls. So keep that in mind. Uh, I think I'm going to go check out Cherokee. Alright, about to enter the waterfall area. Do you see it yet? Okay, you will soon, unless I trip. You see it? Wow, that's nice. That's really cool. The water is like all different colors. You see, it's like a blue, turquoise, brown. Get as close as I can get. Wow. This was worth it. Check this out. Really cool. So here it is. Here's the overlook into the canyon. So you can see all of this is the canyon here cutting away the river is down there so Cloudland Canyon worth checking out nice to take a dip in the waterfall afterwards <laughs> 